For this one, we're going to be going over the dev update that was released earlier today. And I'll leave a link to the dev update in the description if you want to go check it out. But a lot of stuff that they went over were things that we've already discussed. They mentioned how we're going to be getting new military weapons and new shadow ops heroes, including a soldier who has new abilities. And they also went over the changes that they made to energy ammo. And I've already gone into detail over these new items in a previous video. I'll leave a link to it in the description if you haven't checked it out yet. But the thing I wanted to go over was the new perk reroll feature, which is expected to be released with patch 4.2. And we're supposed to get patch 4.2 sometime during the week of May the 15th. Now with the new reroll feature, you're not going to be able to reroll the entire weapon. Instead, you're going to be able to reroll individual perks. So you'll only be able to change like one perk on the weapons that you reroll. And it's not going to cost V-Bucks to reroll your weapons. Instead, it's going to require in-game resources. And we'll also be able to choose which perk we want to reroll. Now, they did mention that not all weapons are going to be rerollable. I'm not sure which weapons those include. If I had to guess, I would say maybe like event weapons or founders weapons. But as of right now, we don't know which weapons will be rerollable and which ones won't be. And they also mentioned that some will have specific options, which they didn't really go into detail over. And that sums up all of the information they provided when it comes to rerolls. Let me know what y'all think about it. And they didn't really discuss mini bosses in the video, but they did include a clip of a mini boss. And this mini boss doesn't seem to be attacking any type of objective. And it kind of looks like this mini boss just randomly spawned on the map. And the second thing I wanted to point out when it comes to mini bosses is that it looks like they're going to be dropping loot. You can see that after he killed the mini boss, it dropped some ammo as well as some building materials. And he also dropped a purple item. I'm not exactly sure what it is when I first saw it. I thought it was an active power cell, but evidently this is something new and different. So not only will mini bosses be spawning randomly, they'll also be dropping building materials, ammo, and some other resources as well. And this sums up everything I wanted to go over in the dev update. Let me know what y'all think about this new information in the comments below. I hope y'all enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.